Hey guys, King Cade here and welcome back to another video. So in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to complete the second part of the RB Battles Challenge. So once you complete this part right here, what you want to do is you want to quickly jump on top of the train. So go out here and actually let's go ahead and wait a sec so those things don't like obliterate us. And we actually want to jump on top of the train. So yeah, there's a little glass bit right here. But right here, we can actually jump on top of the train, and here we go. So you just want to wait until we go through this door, and you want to jump on top of this, and you want to jump on top of this metal thing right here, and go right over here. So this is where the next area we need to do is called the construction facility. And we can actually collect these things right here, and yeah, they actually give us power, which is pretty nice. So let's collect this one as well. So there we go, and we now have 20% power. And now if you hold F, you can actually control this little robot. So there we go, I'm not entirely sure. There we go. So we just go ahead and click on them. And now we can control them. The controls are kind of weird. Like we can control them easily. It's just that the controls are kind of delayed. So what we need to do, we need to charge into these things right here. So let's click mouse button. And yeah, there we go. So all you do is click to charge into the wooden crates. And there we go. And now I believe we can like exit this dude. Okay, so to exit him, just click the button you click to do it. So for me, it was F. And dang, I just used all my power right there accidentally. But now we're in here and now we can go ahead and do the next part. So let's go ahead and jump on this. Make sure you don't fall down. Over here, let's go ahead and collect this thing and then we'll hold F again. So let's collect this. And what is that? Reset. Let's not click that. So go ahead and hold F. Let's click on this dude again. There we go. Now control him. Go up here. And now charge into this one right here. So let's charge into it. There we go. And I think I actually missed it. So charge into it. Charge into it again. And then also charge into this one. Then let's go over here. And let's go up this ramp. And we want to charge into the one on the right. So like this. Let's charge into this one. Charge into it again. And there we go. We can go ahead and click F to escape now. And now let's go ahead and run over there. Make sure we collect this thing as well. Also, watch out for those little robots because they do want to attack you when you aren't controlling them. Alright, so now let's go ahead and get across this. Make sure that you don't fall off the edge or else you'll have to like restart the entire thing. And also watch out for those turrets. I didn't even see those, but they are trying to kill you, so watch out for those. So now from here, what we want to do, we want to go ahead and take a left over here. Make sure you still watch out for those because they still do want to kill you. And now let's go over here. So jump up there. And now let's go ahead and jump back, jump onto this thing, and alright, we barely made that. Alright, so just keep going this way. You could take the thing on the left right there, but I think we're just going to go ahead and jump up like that just in case. And now go ahead and stand on here, and your power pack should be like boosted again, full with energy. Yep, there we go. We now have 100% energy once again. And we can see the robot dude over there that we were like trying to defeat last time, but we didn't even need to do that. And now once we got our energy... We want to fly up there. So you fly by clicking shift, which is this bottom right one down here. And let's go ahead and test it. Yep, there we go. So make sure you don't use all of your energy too quickly. Let's actually go ahead and do this kind of like Flappy Bird because we don't want to waste all of our energy. There we go. Awesome. Now I click on this and we're just going to override it. And it should go ahead and face it at the robot down there. So let's go ahead and click these so it matches up with the yellow dots. There we go. Awesome. And there we go. So that one is overrided. And it should turn that way and face at him. Yep, there we go. And all right, so it looks like they both turned at him. And there he goes. He just got obliterated. Dang. And now what we want to do, we want to go ahead and go back down there. You will have to use your jetpack a little bit. So make sure you save your energy. And yeah, so every time you use your jetpack, you can still double jump and leap. So that is what I recommend doing. So now let's go ahead and head in here. So now just keep going straight. Go right over here and go up the elevator. So over here, let's go ahead and go up the elevator. So you just have to wait for that blue thing to go down, by the way. Now let's go up there. And now once you get up there, you want to be super careful because there's tons of spiders and turrets that are trying to kill you. But what we're trying to do, we gotta go around and we're trying to get up there to that blue trap door in the ceiling. So let's go up there and all right, so it looks like those things do kind of break. So, yeah, so watch out for all of these. I recommend not attacking them because you'll probably draw, die if you try attacking them. So watch out for these turrets. I heard that your health does regenerate if you do take damage. It just takes a little bit to actually do so. And over here, so that blue ladder over there is what we are trying to get to. And I accidentally swung right there. Swinging does slow you down, so I definitely recommend not doing that. So let's go up here. Let's try to jump up the wall. And there we go. Awesome. And it doesn't look like those purple things break. It looks like they just slant. So yeah, so they won't break completely. So up here, 
and go up the ladder. And once you're up the ladder, you'll pretty much be safe as long as you stand like right here. So that's so we're safe for a little bit. And now what we want to do, we want to head over here. So now that we're over here, here is this big hallway. So now what you want to do, run in here, but don't go too fast because there are things that would kill you at the very end of this hallway that you don't want to run into. So here we go. Let's run down here. Nope, net punk server room. So what you want to do is don't step into those lights. So that greenish yellow light, don't step into them. They do move pretty slowly, but they do eventually move. So, yep, it looks like this one right here is moving. So let's just stay behind this wall and let's wait until there's a pretty clear path. All right, so here we go. Looks like it moved back. So, all right, there we go. Awesome. And I'm not sure if we can go this way. Let's go ahead and try it. So right there. Awesome. And okay, that one is moving closer. It is kind of buggy-ish, but just make sure you don't touch the light. So we actually are being pushed back right now. And oh, no. All right, so there we go. And oh no, all right, let's just, and dang, we died. So, so just avoid those lights, make it to the very end of that hallway. And there, then there's a thing that you actually have to hack. So just hack that. And yeah, that is all we know for now. So I'll make a video on what you do once you finish hacking that. And yeah, so that's gonna go ahead and be all for this video though. So make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and turn on post notifications. And I'll see y'all in the next video.